Yo, what's going on, boys? How you doing? Xena in Overprime has just been released. She is basically a ninja. She carries around a huge sword and a lot of swag. And uh, all of her abilities are just insane. So I'm going to go through them one by one as I level up. So you don't need to know literally everything at the start. Um, but I am solo lane this game instead of jungle. She is clearly supposed to be a jungler based on the starting item preference. Uh, I think I will just do this. How mana heavy are her abilities? Let's see. Not mana heavy at all. So I'll go a multi potion here and throw myself at the solo lane. Now, my first ability is probably going to be. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> Probably just going to be my Q. So what my Q does is uh, it's a little slash in front of me. And that's that's literally it. It's just a, a spin slash. Cuts everyone in front of me. And also, while doing damage, as long as I hit an enemy with my Q, I gain a shield that scales with magical power. So you can build her either way. Obviously, all of her other stuff is physical. So you kind of just want to do uh, physical with her. But if you want to be weird... Magical works just fine. Um, her E ability is a, another slash that she doesn't really do anything special there. It's just another slash, but the slash is a knockup, which is pretty big. Oh man, we got a we got a Xena lane, a Xena lane, boys. Want to make sure I'm last hitting here. Oh, yeah. I am winning this battle, my boy. Gotta be careful. Oop. I'm one minion away. Perfect. Alright, so I'm gonna level my E here and knock up. And that's her blink. Perfect. Perfect, that knock up. So, like I said, that E... Nothing really special about it other than that, the fact that it's a CC ability. Um, it's just a normal... Here, I'll just show you. Normal backflip slash. It looks super sick and it does give you um, that knockup. And then her right click, which I don't actually have yet, is a chargeable dash. And the longer you charge it, the further it goes. And also... The longer you charge it, I think um, the damage is built up as well. It says charging distance and damage increases if the hero builds up energy for longer. So you can charge it not only for more movement, but more damage. Pretty good stuff. Ouch. Hello. I actually won that fight. I don't know how. Oh, she has the red gem. That's why. I don't think I'm going to grab my... Actually, I will grab my right click just so I can show you here. So I can pick it, and then the longer I charge it, the further it dashes. And the best part about it, in my opinion, is that you can use it while moving. Pretty absurd. Now, I'm going to build her tanky, which I don't know if that's the right play or not, but it seems like it will be a lot of, a lot of really good gamer sense to build her tanky. Especially because this green gem is already doing work for me. All right, let's fight Lappy. That is your real name. Oh, hello. Perfect. So as you saw there, I used my dash to actually clear wave a little bit. I did a lot of damage, man. That dash, that dash hurts. I still have a blink, so I kill her here, I think. Yep. Massive kill. No! Nice, I got it. Super good kill there. And go ahead and go through there. That right click is so good. Oh my gosh. That right click is so nuts. Holy. Now, I'm fighting a physical character, so instead of buying this 
500 magical defense. I need two of these anyways. So I'm going to grab two of those and uh, get 20 physical the defense. Enemy tower is under attack. I am playing, by the way, with Yas, but he's a little sick right now, so he's not talking. But he is here, I swear. Um, and so the last ability I need to tell you guys about is her ultimate, which is pretty awesome. Um, it's kind of like Master Yi Q if you play League of Legends. But what it does is it attacks five people at random, uh, five enemy heroes. It doesn't... Uh, I think it prioritizes heroes, but it will attack normal minions. And it attacks five times on the fifth and final hit. It will do a big lots of damage. Oh, yeah. You got to be scared, my boy. You got to be scared. I'm ulting you. Pow, 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 pow. Boom. Massive damage. Holy. So as you saw there, um, there was minions around. But because there was also a player around, it prioritized the player over anything else. I am just gonna make sure you have no fun right now. Let's go, dude. Oh my God. That's so good. If you're wondering what I did, I dashed past her so that her ability would miss. Immediately canceled my dash into a knockup so she can't blink away because she's CC'd. And during that knockup, I used my Q. And that finished her off. I think that's the combo, man. Dash through. You dash through. You knock up before they have a chance to react. And you smack them with the Q. And by the way, I'm maxing the Q because the fighting potential of the Q is really good. It doesn't do as much damage as the right click. Um, but what it does do really, really well is it still does a good amount of damage. And then on top of that, it gives you that massive shield. Which is the whole reason I'm doing it. Oh, you want to fight? Nice. I don't know if I want to fight this because he has all. Oh, actually, I have all two. I cannot see what's happening here. Perfect. Perfect, dude. Alright, so I ulted. I actually almost killed both Where of them. <laughs> we are I actually almost killed both of them, but... Um... I ended up just deciding... Instead of fully committing and probably trading myself one for one, because I'm already ahead, I think the better play is to just use my dash to get out. That dash is a really far range. Coupled with the blink that I just used, dude, that is... Very survivable. Look at this clear, man. Good clear. Alright, I got... Uh, I think I'll put that ability in my, my dash. A little more dash, damn. So my Q does only slightly more damage than my normal auto attack, huh? But it gives me that shield. I don't know. I think you can you can definitely mess around and figure out what you want to level on her. But uh, the Q seems like a safe bet. The right click seems like you are going to go for murder. Like you're going for blood. There's no farming. There's no laning phase. It's only fight. That's all you know if you're going if you max the right click. But it is a fun way to play, so. Okay. We traded alts there. I think I'm okay with that. I got some potions. I gotta make sure this twang doesn't gank me, though. Oh, nice play. I thought I uh, I thought I was fast enough. But I wasn't. The 
Where are you going? Um, I'm gonna dash through this wave, do some damn. Now that does give me my Zim toy, which makes me extremely tanky and uh, really hard to kill if anyone messes with me. By the way, through all of this, in case you're wondering, I am looking at duo lane and uh, seeing if I can grab a kill by using this teleporter. So as a solo laner, your job is pretty much to make sure that you're counter ganking if need be. Now, I know th there are... 3v2, but the howitzers going in, they're going in too, so everyone on the team's heading over there. I don't really need to teleport. Oh, you want to fight me, huh? I do not think you win this. Look at that. last hitting. I could actually TP now. I'm going to TP now. Killing this Narbosh. Perfect. Perfect gank, dude. Landed the double with it, too. Um, What do I want to go here, item-wise? I kind of want to go some, some damage now. But maybe I'll actually just go emergency here. What emergency does is... Uh, gives me a big shield if I get a little too low. Which, you know, I'm kind of abusing the shield on my my Q right now, so a couple of little bit more shielding is not bad for me. I'm currently 4 and 0. Really good. Really good. The guy I'm queued with, Yas, he's 5 and 1 in mid. He's logging out. Can't forget about that. So let me see here. This gives me 15% more physical power and a 15% shield if I drop below 30% HP. Damn, it feels... This character feels insanely good. Just like right out the gate. Feels really strong. Look at that damage. Half of her health out the gate. I'm getting ganked. I am getting ganked. Alright, I'm ulting. Perfect. Damn, my ult? You know what's really good about the ult that I just realized? It's not even necessarily the most damage. Which, by the way, it is in insanely high damage. But it's not even about the damage. It's the fact that you are completely immune to everything for that long. Oh my god. I'm, like, immune to enemies right now. I can do literally anything I damn well please. And nobody can say anything to stop me. <laughs> I think now I add some damage. Now we throw up some numbies. I've obviously won my lane. I'm 6-0. and um, I want to just gank duo lane i guess the ally tower is under attack hmm. mid's doing well the enemy tower is under attack the duo lane's not even pushed up that far though so oh she blinked away I don't know why she blinked away when she could have just 
dashed away. I guess because she didn't want me to follow the dash if I did. There it is. There's the solo on the enemy Xena. Now I'm running mid. I could actually use some mana, to be honest. The enemy tower is under attack. This person is here. Big knock up. Just, just doing some dam. Just keeping the damage up. Where are you going? Huh? Oh, where are you going? I got, a, I got one of the best movement abilities in the game too, bro. I'm not scared of nobody. They're gonna take that tower. I'm gonna back out. Upgrade this a uh, little bit of my damage here. Snag that, and I guess I'll just snag another one of those. Mid lane is being hurt. I'm going to go over there. Don't worry. Don't worry, mid lane. I'm here. Knock up. Nice ult. Nice ult, man. All right. I trust you. Oh, I hit her hard with that dash. Oh, my God. I'm flanking around. I'm flanking around. No, oh, he's not there. All right. I went for the flankerooski, but it didn't work. Everything's down right now. We could go spirit, I guess. Team, you want a spirit? I'll tank it because I got my shield. My shield is not massive. I need to build some more cooldown on her. Cooldown is really what's going to be OP on her, I think. By the way, as long as you're circling, you don't take a lot of damage. His normal attacks from the fire spirit don't actually hit you if you're if you're circling. Only his special attacks do. Mm, I guess this is a good back. I can I can buy these two items here, so. Decent back. It's time. Now I just need 800 gold to start doing crazy damage. I'll, I'll get that item. And then I also want to get, um, uh, physical power crit hit. I also want to get this one. Fanatic desert or dessert. Sorry. Gives you a big shield. The ADC was just over here and he ran away. With his tail between his legs. Oh my god. My dash does 512 damage. And I just ranked it up again. Holy, dude. Oh, there's the enemy Xena. Hope you don't mind getting fucked up. Come here. She's running. She's running. She's teleporting. She teleported. Okay. <laughs> hmm. The prime disappears in one minute. Oh, I'm coming mid. I'm coming mid. Oh my god, you can't get away from me. You cannot get away from me. Also, for a lot of people who don't know this, any character with a dash ability, you can actually dash on top of this by jumping and letting your dash ability go off. The verticality of this game is definitely something that you 
need to keep in mind and actually implement. Well, I'm down to try to get this. Perfect. Um, we could just do prime, honestly. Oh, you wanna you wanna fight me? You wanna fight me, Sparrow? Was that it? Nice try, Bozo. I'm gonna ult this guy. And kill him. Dash in for another fight. Knock up. Massive, dude. Oh my god. She's so mobile in fights. She's so mobile in these fights. Let's snag this tower. I am 8 0 right now. I'm gonna hit the back button. I got a lot of gold. Grab the hurricane. Start the desert. I'm gonna do this blue buff. I really need mana, actually. It's one thing I will say about this character is she seems extremely mana hungry. Oh, is he doing prime? All right, I'm coming. I'm coming, buddy. I'm on my way, Poppy. Meow. What does this guy think he's doing? Mr. TB. Welcome to the real world, buddy. Holy shit. <laughs> Yo, I do so much. I do so much damage. Oh my gosh. I'm coming mid. I'm coming mid. I'm coming mid. Damn. Oh, good CC. Not good enough because my dash gets the double, baby. Oh, my God. Yo, what's up, bro? Hold up, Twin Bass. Oh, nice salt. Nice salt. Get out of here, Bozo. Oh, hello, Xena. Don't worry, buddy. Don't worry. I got you. Knock up. Peace out, bro. Oh, my God. Wait a second. This might be my new favorite character in the game. You cannot get rid of her in any fight. Holy. Oh, oh, oh. What's up, Kane? Knock up. Oh, you're trying to kill me? Cool. What if I just went invincible? What's up, Narbosh? I want to get in there, but I'm a little low. Oh, but Yas doesn't care. He's in. <laughs> oh, no. No. No, not like this. Ooh. No. <laughs> Damn, the perfect, the perfect non-death record out the window. It's okay. We went for the YOLO end. It happens. That's funny. Holy crap. I have 2,500 gold. I get my, I get my little uh, dessert. And I also want to go mer Merchant's Jewelry Box, I think is a good item. Because you auto attack a lot. And so I think getting these auto attack items, like attack speed, crit chance, power. I think those are going to be really good for you. On this character. Prime's already down, so even though we died, nothing really matters there. We were just pushing because there's a chance we end. If not, oh well, they get spirit. Spirit doesn't matter. 
I'm alive. Also, by the way, level 16 would be probably level 18 if we didn't go for the end right there. So, farming machine. I am taking buffs, by the way, because I feel like they're best suited on me. I'm auto attacking so much with red buff and as a melee character. You really uh, need to make sure that you're keeping your movement speed up. So. Okay. Hornark just blasted my whole wave away from me. Hornark mm. pinged something. Someone over here? Oh no. Oh, Yas is getting fucked on by Xena. Hello. Oh my gosh. Dude. So good. Holy. I'm just diving into a hundred people. What are they going to do to me? Kill me? Yeah. All right. I'll believe it when I see it. Big stun by Narball. I just stood in the entirety of Sparrows 2 and uh, didn't take any damage. Oh, I want to help kill this Quang. Or I'll help the Quang by killing the Sparrow, I guess. Wang, I'm coming to kill you. No, not my teammate. I knocked him up. You're safe. You're safe, best friend. I have no mana, so I lose this fight, I'm pretty sure. Never mind. All I have to do is left click and I kill them. Imagine. I'll grab that. They got it back anyways. Pretty much wiped them. Oh god, Yas. Oh god. <laughs> I just saw you getting chased around by that twin blast. <laughs> Absolutely dumped on. Alright. Um, they just need to run, honestly. I don't think they can fight that. But I can fight that. I really think I can win this fight, but I don't know if I have the mana for it is the only issue. Like, I'm definitely high enough level and, and good enough build and just, like, in general good enough, but winning the fight seems tough. Oh, we both dashed away at the same time. Oh, I got knocked up. Oh my gosh. Yo, that howitzer ult was nuts, Yas. That ult did so much damage. Oh, big knockback. Not enough, but big. All right. I think, I think we're trolling a bit, so we got to get back on track here. 10-4. Is that your record? No. <laughs> Imagine if it was 10-4 and you said 10-4. That would be funny. 12-6. Poggies. I'm 14-2, and two, so... I think... Yas, can you type what your opinion on the new character is based on what I've been saying? Do you think she's OP? Do you think she's a little not good enough or what? Because right now I'm built mostly defense. Like I have Zim's toy and then I have emergency rescue kit. 
she's damn good. She sticks to you. Yeah, she's very good. I think so too. I will say though, that mana hungriness does not feel good. I want to go kill that wind blast, but I don't think I'll get there in time. The enemy core is under attack. The twin blast is right here. Oh my god, my ultimate. Like, you just can't run from this thing, man. You just cannot run from this. Oh, coming. Where are you going, Xena? I would love to play her in jungle and see what kind of damage she can do. If I go full power. Do you want that? The enemy inhibitor is respawning soon. Oh, I can actually go and grab my uh my jewelry box now. I should definitely do that because that's a big power spike for me. Um, can we group? Because if we do prime, I'm pretty sure we just win the game by default. I'm pretty sure the prime will kill. Okay. Ow. Perfect. Oh, by the way, if you get a kill with your dash, you get to use it again. Which is just not allowed, really. Shouldn't be okay. Ouch. Triple? Oh, no, that could have been a penta. It's okay. I think we just won the game here. We just win. We just win. GG, dude. And that, my friends, is the uh, the first look of Xena or Zena. I don't know how you say it. She, in my opinion, is incredibly strong. Like I went 18 and 2, first time playing her. 40,000 damage. Howie came close, but he's Howie. So, like, and he's a Howie that's 13 and 6. Like, he, he did really good. Uh, as for damage reduced, I'm top of the mitigated board. Top of the damage received, top of the mitigated, top of the damage dealt to heroes and to Teons. So, I don't know, man. <laughs> it's pretty insane. Pretty insane. I, I'd imagine. Maybe a little bit of fine tuning that needs to be done on her, but uh, she's always she seems insane. Let me know what your thoughts of her are, um, and I'll see you guys later. If you enjoy the video, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And until next time, y'all, peace.